In the last 100 days in this world, we got as rich as possible. And we got pretty rich. I'm a man with everything. Well, almost everything. Because in this 100 days, we'll be catching as many mobs as possible and putting them on display in a mob gallery. Look at this. It's a gallery of mobs. I mean, that's cool. Admit it, that's cool. And it wasn't easy either. So if you want to see how I did it, stick around until the end of the video. And if you want to enjoy it, consider subscribing. It's free and we're going for 1 million by the end of the year. And with your help, I'm pretty sure we can do it. But without further ado, I spent 100 days collecting as many mobs as possible in Minecraft Hardcore mode. And here's how many we caught. It's day uno, and I'm back with the villagers. Yeah, that's right, those guys who made me what I am, who gave me everything. Those people that I milked for all of those emeralds. Well, I'm about to milk them some more, but not just emeralds, no. I'm milking them for name tags too, but also emeralds. But not these emeralds, they're my beacon emeralds. No, I need some fresh, I need some I need some new emeralds. Because I'm gonna need to buy all the name tags I can get. I hear you say, but why name tags? Well, all will be explained. But first, I need to fix all of my tools in this completely overpowered XP farm, and then I need to find a jungle biome. I hear you say, but why a jungle biome? Why so many questions? Huh? All right, fine, fine. I'll explain. A wise boy once said, Pokemon, gotta catch them all. First part doesn't apply to me. Second part, I'm all about that. I'm all about that catching them all life. That was true in his day, and it's true in mine. That's right. We're spending 100 days catching them all. Who's them, you ask? Everyone. We're catching everyone. We're catching everyone out here. Well, more like collecting. We're collecting everyone. And where better to start than the jungle? This place is teeming with life. Look at this. Look at this panda. We're gonna catch him. This cat? Yep. That parrot? You bet. I'm, I'm sorry, but this is the best feature in the game. Just watching this guy eat. It gives me unusual amounts of satisfaction watching this guy eat. But I don't have time to sit around all day watching them all. I gotta catch them all. And I need a base to start all that catching. So I began the deforestation station. All right, listen, we'll, we'll, we'll make a better name in the future, but it doesn't matter. Names aren't important right now. What's important is that we catch everything in sight, regardless of its feelings towards being caught. So day five, I continued clearing an area in the rain. It was miserable. It was not fun. Then I went in search for a sheep to make a bed, found a sheep, sheared a sheep, killed a sheep, slept. Anyways, day six, my human instincts kicked in and I realized I could do things a lot more efficiently if I just stopped caring about the environment around me. And so I started burning the forest down like a smart person. But you know who's not smart? This fool. He didn't realize it, but he was to be the first thing I caught. The second thing I caught was his llama, who I put in the first of many cages. However, day eight rolled around and the llama was no longer there. He had somehow escaped along with his person. So now I'm the fool, I guess? Luckily, there was a cow nearby that I stole. I brought him back, caged him up and named him Milkshake. But my thirst is far from being quenched. So I instantly went out and searched for more and found a chicken and a pig. I led them back and on day nine, we had some new members to the club, introducing Crispy Bacon and Shere Khan. Day 10, I continued burning down the forest because it was blocking my sunrise. There it is. I then found a new llama and a sheep and began dragging them back to the base in, in the dark with, with creepers. Lots, lots of creepers. But we got back, I tied them both up and in the morning, I named the sheep Chops, caged them up and then tried out using glass instead because then I can see my subjects better. I headed to the nether to collect some shroom lights and placed them all at the base of the cages so that I can see my subjects even in the dark. I then replaced all of the iron bars with glass and it looked a little bit less evil, which is probably not a bad thing. Day 13, I spent in the nether collecting quartz so that I could replace the cobblestone because, well, I, I want to come across as more of a wealthy hunter, you know? I named the llama Larry and now Larry the llama is trapped. Day 15, I went out in search of more tenants and came across this blue bird. I forced him to eat seeds until he loved me and he actually willingly followed me back to the base, which was nice. And then I just sort of, just sort of pushed him into the cage and, uh, and gave him a very lazy but accurate name. But, but trust me, the names get worse than that. That's barely scratching the surface. I then saw an ocelot and told him he's next and to watch his back because I'm coming for him. And I wasn't lying. The next day, I went out and searched for him with a single fish, which unsurprisingly wasn't enough. He ran away. So the next day I spent fishing and chopping and fed him fish until he loved me. So I started walking back under the assumption that he'd follow me, but he didn't. And that's why we have leads. But I had run out of materials for another cage. So I went back to the nether. And while there, I found a nether fortress that we found in the first 100 days. And so I knew the portal to my old base was nearby. So I did a bit of searching and sure enough, I found it. This was gonna make life a lot easier. So day 19, I made a safer path back to the other portal and carried on making some more cages. 
Day 20, I locked up boots and collected even more materials. I continued expanding my base and collecting some more gunpowder for rockets from my gunpowder farm. But I had no more rockets to get up there with, so I had to do it the old fashioned way. Day 22, I AFK'd and the next day I had nearly two stacks of gunpowder to make some more rockets with. Then I realized that a super easy mob to capture would be a snow golem because I could literally birth him into the cage. That was that was the wrong way of saying it. I take that back. Anyway, I found some pumpkins and on day 24, I made Mr. Freeze the snowman. I tried collecting some turtles, but those guys are going to be hard to catch as you can't lead them. So I, I can live without a turtle for now. I continued looking through the thick, vast jungle and the next day came across that panda from day four. He was still there, being fat. So of course, I fed him some more. Yeah, I have to. I have to. But you can't lead pandas either for some reason, and so I had to come up with a different plan. I decided I would build a minecart track and minecart him back to the base. Yes. Yes, it, it took a, a long time. It was not fun. We were nowhere near the base, not even slightly. This jungle is absolutely ginormous. But I did find one of those jungle building things. So that's cool if you're into jungle buildings. I spent the next few days working on the minecart and finally it was time to watch him go. <laughs> but not from this world, so we're gonna have to stop that. Okay, so then I had to make everything three blocks wide, but once I did that, I powered up all the rails, and he was a panda in a minecart going go, going to his, his, his cage. He got stuck, so I had to push him for the last stretch, but it's fine. We made it back, and Chonka was loving life. I couldn't get him out of the minecart though, so yep, he's staying in that. I then made his cage one block higher so he's not hitting his head all the time, and then made him a food dispenser. And now, he's a happy Chonka. I went out and searched for more animals and found a pack of wolves and took two. One for a wolf and one for a dog. And they left a path of destruction and death on our way back to the base, but we got back. I named one of them Sheep Destroyer, but I don't have any more name tags. So it's time to chop down some more trees. Hang on, hang on a second, I've just chopped down half a rainforest. I've got wood at home. Yep, that'll do. So I traded it all with the villagers. Okay, nearly three stacks. Let's see how much this gets me. Okay, not too bad. All right, let's go and trap those dogs. Okay, here we are. So sh sheep destroyer and dog, 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 the dog. Ah, but he's not a dog yet. Now he's a dog, 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 the dog. Perfect. How you getting on there, buddy? How you getting on there? Yeah, 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 yeah. Dog, 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 the dog, and sheep destroyer, the wolf. So we now have eleven. The chicken still doesn't want to come up. And next, I think we should, I think we should try and get a rabbit. We can probably get a rabbit from the desert. Bring it in through the nether portal. Okay, rabbits, rabbits. Come here, little guy. Don't run now. Don't run. Don't die either. Okay. Don't listen to me then. Ah, come here. Ah, uh, you're mine. Let's get some insurance. Oh no, the other one's gone. Ah. All right, forget it. I got no idea where that other one went. Oh, there he is. Moi. Ah. Ah. Oh, hang on a second. I can get a cat as well. A cat is not an ocelot. And I've got an ocelot. Or oh, however you pronounce that. Where's the other one? All right, forget it. We're doing it with one. Be careful now. That's it. That's it. I mean, what happened? That was kind of funny. You gotta admit, it was kind of it's kind of funny how he died like that. Here we are again. Ah, perfect. Perfect. Come here. Let's try this again, eh? <laughs> no. Oh, come on. Okay, all right, okay. Let's think about this. Let's think about this for a second. Let's make a little wall. Okay, now he only has the choice to run down there. Come with me. Oh, can I get two? Can I get two? Ha 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 ha. Sorry. Go on in, that's it, that's it. No, oh. All right, okay, we got one. We got one. No, no. Why? Oh, he's still alive. Probably just barely. But that's fine. I'll take just barely. That's it. Is he seriously dangling? All right, well, this isn't gonna happen, is it? Okay, noted. Cover this tree up. Okay, that should do it. That should do it. Uh, <laughs> let's try again. Come here. I'm not gonna hurt you. You'll probably do that yourself. Okay, good, good, good. Come here. Come here. You're doing great. Keep this up and you might not kill yourself. Okay, now be careful here. Because last time... <sighs> <laughs> what is it with rabbits and this staircase? Maybe I should just try and look for one at home. Yeah, sounds like a better idea. You agree, Nether Llama? Yeah. Okay, new mission. Find a rabbit that doesn't mean I have to cross dimensions to catch. Gotta be one somewhere, right? Gotta be rabbits around here somewhere. Unless they all killed themselves, which is likely. I think I've actually seen every single mob in the game apart from uh, apart from a rabbit. Actually, that's a good point. Donkeys. Donkeys and horses. I still need to trap donkeys and horses. And bees. Man, there are still so many things I haven't caught. So many trophies I don't have. So many lives not ruined. <laughs> I don't even have a village yet. Actually, let's check out this temple. I don't think I've ever been in one. Cool. 
Cool. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's a no on the rabbits for a while. Uh, let's try horses. They're pretty easy to catch. That is if I have a saddle. And I really, I really hope I have a saddle. Yes! Okay, nice. I do. Oh, let's see if I can catch this cat real quick. <laughs> easy. Okay, I don't know how much you know about rabbits, but they do this thing where they love to die on staircases. Um, can you not do that? Brilliant. Uh... Just play it cool here. Okay, there we are. Nice. Nether llama, keeping the nether safe. Good job. Good job, my friend. See, I'm not cheating. Ocelot, cat. Ocelot, cat. Two completely different things. Perfect. Perfect. Now come and get in this cage. On there. No, no, no. Now, now, come on now. No. Mm. You're a tricky one, aren't you, Mr. Alexander Middlesworth? No, stop. Oh, dude. Why do you instantly want to climb out of things? Now I just stretch this thing out until it pops. Trapped. There we are. Right, what was I doing? Oh yeah, horses. Horses. This is probably going to be the easiest one since I can literally ride it into captivity. <laughs> hey, bud. There we are. Sorry about that. My bad. I think I know where I'm going. Well, that was easy. Okay, I could probably do that same thing that I just did with that horse, but to a donkey instead, right? You can ride donkeys, I think. Need to find a donkey first. Okay, so then I got distracted with bees for a bit. I actually managed to lead one, but then I broke their home and then they, they hit me and I, and I started dying from poison. And then as I was taking him back, he just died. So yeah, I was a little bit confused, uh, but I did find another one. Come down, that's not fair. Come on, Barry B. Benson. Yes. Well, at least you're easy to travel with. Here we go, Barry. We're doing it. Aha! Donkeys. Perfect. Oh, you can ride them. Even better. Yes. Yes. Kind of slow, though. Kind of slow, not gonna lie. Here we are, donkey. Welcome to the rest of your life. Donkey the donkey. Okay, that's 15. That's, that's 15. I think it's about time we worked on this, uh, we worked on this bad mob area bad mob area yeah yeah that's a good name for it today's 43 to 47 i was working on the bad mob area cleared out all that dirt and made our land a little bit bigger and then worked on more cages let's see if we can get some mobs from this uh little cave down here okay i don't really want to i don't really want to go for a creeper right away um, I was thinking more like skeleton or something. Sorry. I can hear a slime. Where's the slime? I couldn't find the slime anyway. It, it, really weird. Still don't know what happened. Uh, I heard it. It was really close. I spent ages looking around and, uh, never found it again. So, I definitely heard a slime. Okay, well that is just weird. I am sure I heard a slime. Hello. Ah, I need to name you first, actually. Spoodor. I just realized this would be much easier to do in the daytime. Even though, for some reason, he's not attacking me right now. Never mind. Lead? No. Guess I'm just gonna have to push you in. Don't make me use the boat. <laughs> uh, <laughs> played. Absolutely played. Right, I guess we'll just wait until nighttime then. Hang on a second, there's a swamp right here. Maybe some slimes will spawn. This is where, this is where uh, slimes live, right? It is indeed where slimes live. However, I never found one. I'm not gonna lie, I, I wasted a pretty long time looking for a slime. This is valuable time wasted. Uh, after that weird slime experience, I, I was pretty obsessed with finding slimes. Gotta be some slimes here. Big old swamp. Never mind then, I guess. All right, who's next? Who have we got down here? Okay, okay. Come on then, boys. Oh, wait, I'm gonna have to wait until nighttime, aren't I? Well, I suppose not with the creeper. Okay, let's let's see how this goes. Okay, what, what's the game plan here? What's the, how am I gonna do this? Yeah, you know what? That's actually gonna take some thought. And uh, I can't be bothered with that right now. So, well, I might as well do some chores while I'm waiting. Okay, let's let's get a name tag ready. Let's get a name tag ready for the zombie. Derek, or at least I think that's how you spell Derek. You know what? Let's try and get a skeleton in the same night. I'm gonna call I'm gonna call the skeleton Stormtrooper because they also have terrible aim. Unless you're in hardcore and then they have pinpoint accuracy aim. So that's, it's not actually accurate. I'm so happy that they all haven't despawned. I guess we still have time. Oh, I haven't, I haven't fed Chonker in a while. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Anyone down here? Hello, my friend. Follow me this way. That's it. Just up here. I think it's okay for you. Okay, it's not. Never mind. Come back down. Come back down. Chill out. Chill out. Here we go. There we are. Oh, there's a bat. There's a bat. How do I trap him? How am I going to trap him? How do you trap a bat? No. Easy. Easy. Okay, I gotta name that bat, otherwise he's gonna despawn. What are we gonna name the bat? I'm gonna call him no 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 no. You know, like the like the Batman uh uh intro. Because that's uh funny. That's funny. That was actually easy. I mean, yeah, I still have to get him in, in a in a bot in a one by one box, but okay. 
Derek. Come with me, mate. Which one's Derek? Derek? Okay, there's Derek. That's Derek. Don't hit Derek. Okay, Derek. Derek, come over here, bro. That's it. That's it. That's it. You fool. You... What? Okay, Derek. Through here. Through here. Fool. Absolute fool. Played. Played. Okay, now I just need to do that with a skeleton. This is... Oh, this is gonna be annoying, isn't it? Ooh! Hello. Oh, there's two of you. Okay, you come with me. You know what? You you can be called Stormtrooper for the for the sake of for the sake of ease. Played. Oh, oh no, I'm getting played. I'm getting played. I'm massively getting played here. Ah, his dad's here. Stormtrooper, don't do this. Get in there. Don't don't make me get the boat. All right, I'm getting the boat. I didn't I didn't want it to come to this. I really didn't. Ha <laughs> ha. Fool. Oh, that was easy. That was easy, Stormtrooper. I thought you'd be a harder opponent than that. Honestly, I really did. Okay, I got a new name for the for the uh, for the skeleton. Man, he really should have been called Stormtrooper. I don't know how he's managing not to hit me from there. I mean, I really should have called him Stormtrooper. There you are. Yeah, what now? What now? Nothing. Man, look at this. What a productive night. What a productive night. I, I, I bet we could get a creeper, you know? I really do think we can get a creeper. And it's a good thing too, because we don't need the night time to get a creeper. And I like that. Hey, buddy. Buddy, come with me, come with me. There it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, now, basically what I'm thinking is we make a uh, little staircase like so, just like so, and um, yeah, okay. And then, we, and then we sort of hit him into it. You gotta time it right though, you gotta time it right. It's all about timing it right. Yes, oh, that was so easy. That was, I honestly, I thought that would be hard. Man, what a productive night. Look at this, look at them all. Okay, let, let's try and get a drowned. Let's try and get a drowned. I bet I could do that as well. Can't I just trap a normal a normal one and then drown him? Is that a thing? Let's try that. All right, one at a time though. One at a time. Come on now. Okay, now I just do this, right? We'll check back on him in a minute. I'm pretty sure that's going to work though. I'm pretty sure that's a thing. Now I just got to name this sucker. Listen, I have no idea, all right? I'm running out of names. What? Hmm... Do they have do they have to be in water? I mean it's a good job I didn't name this anything to do with zombies. I can just reuse this. I can call anything Sylvester Stallone. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what it is. I am gonna need some more name tags though. Actually, that's a good point. Why haven't I made my beacon? So that's exactly what I did. I, I made my beacon and I even gave myself a little jump boost. Look at that. Alright, let's go and get some more name tags. Okay, 15. Not bad, not bad. While I'm here, I'm actually going to spend the rest of the day up in this gunpowder farm so I can get myself some more gunpowder. Okay, next up, I think we should get a charged creeper because I kind of want... It's kind of a tough one, but I, I want the charged creeper next to the normal creeper. So that's kind of that's kind of something we got to do now. So in that case, we need a trident. Why, you ask? Well, I'm pretty sure... Now, now don't quote me on this, and this may be a complete waste of time, and I should probably research it, but I'm pretty sure a trident with channeling can summon light lightning which means if i summon it onto a creeper that boy's gonna get charged so yeah let's go and find one. Oh no i'm getting a hundred days in an ocean only world flashbacks i can't see anything with this shader time to turn it off Ugh. so i searched the ocean far and wide for anything in possession of a trident the only things they had were fishing rods i don't need fishing rods if you could just hold a trident that would be great I carried on the search, which led me to a, a, an isle, a literal island of mobs. Every mob in the game met up here. Why? Then I got distracted for a bit and went on a treasure hunt. And then I got distracted for a bit and went to a village. But then I carried on and eventually I found one. Finally, get out of here. I have no idea where I'm going. Lost is an understatement. Okay, back. Finally. Finally, I'm back. Glad you all haven't despawned. <laughs> all right, nice. Now we just have to put uh, channeling on this. So let's, uh, let's get to the enchantment farm. And I don't have any lapis, do I? Nope. Back home I go. Oh, I just realized I, I destroyed my bed as well. So this is going to put me at the world spawn. Oh, no. Yep. <laughs> Yep, there we are. wonder if that dragon egg is around here somewhere. Because it fell through. When I tried to collect it, it fell through in, into the into the portal. Which means it gets put somewhere here, right? Yeah, dude, I can count that. That's a thing. It's a dragon egg. Might not have hatched, but it's a dragon egg. Got a dragon in it, I presume. Yep, that counts. I'm counting that. But Kalani, you can't do that. That's cheap. Yeah, I can. It's uh, it's my video. <laughs> I can do what I want. If I want to count that dragon egg, I'm, I'm counting that dragon egg. Okay, let's not do that again. Okay. Okay, let's see what we get. Yeah, that's not gonna cut it. That's not gonna cut it. We're just gonna keep doing this until we until we get it. And and we've got it. 
Well that, well, that was easy. I'm breaking on it and then mending. And there we are. Well, that took all of 15 seconds. So actually, I might as well repair this quickly because that will also take all of 15 seconds. Wonderful. You got to love that. You got to You got to love that it comes. I mean, it's one of the coolest, coolest things in the game by far. Doesn't get much better than that. Give it a name. Actually, let's, let's rename all my tools while we're here. Or not. Never mind then. Well, we've got fork and spoon. Better than nothing, I guess. Back home. Okay, now we just have to wait for a, uh, a thunderstorm, right? And then wherever we fire this, a bolt of lightning will come down. So we just do that on a creeper and boom, supercharged creeper. Today 62, there I was, minding my own business, you know, upgrading my base when I got rudely interrupted. Oh, I could catch them for sure. We got banner boy. There's probably a crossbow boy over there. I don't know. We're going... Oh, yeah. There are a few crossbow boys. Okay. Crossbow boy. Banner boy. I mean, they're different. They're, t they're two different. They're two different things. They count. Come on then, fellas. Ah, listen. It don't count. I might have to boat these guys. So I know this isn't ideal. Let's just block you off for a second. All right. Put this guy here, I guess. Actually, nah. Let's make this the pillager row. This is going to be the pillager row right here. Hopefully, they don't despawn. We should probably extend this the height of this guy. Otherwise, you're never going to see his banner. And then they just look the same. And then I look like I'm a cheater, which I'm not. Well, I mean, that's debatable, but there we are. Day 64, I spent gathering lots of materials to expand the compound. And day 65 to 75, that's exactly what I did. I used this black stone from the nether as a pathway between the cages. And yeah, I thought it looked pretty nice. Unfortunately, the bat did escape while I was building. Whoops. I tried catching him back, but yeah, there was no chance of that. He was a free bat once again. So I carried on. Okay, let's get back to catching some uh, things. While we're waiting for things to catch, I'm going to continue uh, clearing out this area around here, you see. It is so much more effective to just burn everything down. So much more effective. Hang on a second, I can trap one of you in a boat. I'm pretty sure if an enderman is trapped in a boat, he can't escape that thing. Let's test that theory. Let's, let's, let's test it. Yes. Okay, there would have, there's actually a, a much easier way of, of going about this. And then run up here. Let's put him here for now. <laughs> you dummy. All right, Patrick, pipe down. Oh, hang on a second. I can't get up steps. Let's put him let's put him here. I think he's going to be too tall, so we're going to have to expand this. Don't do this, Patrick. Is that Patrick? That is Patrick. Come with me. <laughs> there we are. We got an enderman. Okay, while it's daytime, I'm going to go to the Nether and try and get some uh try and get some Nether mobs cuz they might be pretty easy. Okay, let's see if we can get some of these guys first. That's it, that's it, follow me. Right this way. Excuse me? Nah, that'll do, that'll do. I'll take that, doesn't really matter. This way, my friend. Okay, one sec, I've got, uh, I got to get you a name real quick. One sec, uh, quick, think quick, think quick. Um, um, bleh. I don't know, I had to think quick, okay? I had to think quick. Come on, okay, let's put him right over here. Ha, easy. I ask myself this question. When will there be a challenge? Hello there, you naughty little thing. You'll be a lovely addition. Ah, oh, slowness is the worst. All right, I gotta be quick again. I gotta be quick. No, no. Mm. Okay, okay. You're going in the boat. Man, what an appropriate name. Oh, I put her in the wrong row. She was supposed to go here. That's fine. We'll just, we'll just redo that. We'll just redo that. Okay. Can everyone just please ignore how it's not central? If only I made these paths three wide, then it would all come together. Can I count Nether Llama? I mean, he's he's acclimatized himself so well to the Nether that he practically he's practically a Nether mob. I don't know. Maybe, maybe that's too far. Maybe that's too far. Okay, so we can't have piglins because they just turn into something else. Let's try and get a hog. This will be fun. Ah, yes. I could count a baby one as well, as long as they don't grow up. Do they grow up? I don't know. Can I put you in a boat? Who goes in a boat? You go in a boat. Okay. One of them goes in a boat. But he also dies in a boat. Why is he dying in a boat? <laughs> that looks really weird. Don't die. Don't die. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Oh, he's wreaking havoc. He's he's straight wreaking havoc. That's it, buddy. That's it. That's it. We're almost there. Here we are, you see? Now, just follow me a second, actually. Wait in there. I should really have these prepared before. There we are. Hopefully, he doesn't grow up. Because if he, if he grows up, he might... He might suffocate. There, might, there may not be enough space for him. Hopefully that's not a thing, though. No. Mm. He's one of these. No. Yes. 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 No. 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 Yes. I really hope he doesn't grow up. 
Actually, I know a good one that we could get. Those ones that are in the desert, what are they called? These guys, Desert Boy. Come with me. Yes, Desert Boy. This better be worth it, Desert Boy, because you, you're really slow, man. I'm not going to lie. Please be careful here. Ooh. Come on, Desert Boy. That's it. There it is. I'd really like a skeleton on a spider. That would be a cool one to have. But if I get a skeleton riding a spider, do I have to name them both or just one? And I'm still waiting for that rainstorm. I really hope that thing comes within 100 days. Hmm. I wonder if I can lead one of these guys. Bro, stop walking away. No. Yes, I can. I did not think that would work. It still might not. Oh, Nether Llama's leaving. His nether arc comes to an end. This guy's a good guy, really, though, right? I mean... I don't know what he does in his spare time, but he doesn't seem to hurt me. Granted, he could kill babies in his spare time, but he doesn't hurt me. Just stay there, my friend. And there we are. Okay, we out here looking for some rare mobs. Well, I'm seeing a lot of mobs, but none of them are rare. Okay, well, I don't want this to be a wasted trip. So uh, there is someone that we can get. Hello, you two. Ah, uh, wait, yeah. How am I gonna, how am I gonna do this? Okay, I'm gonna have to do this one. It's, oh, this is gonna take forever. This is gonna take a really long time. Okay, don't panic. Don't panic. That's it, that's it. Okay, brilliant, don't run off. Welcome to paradise, my friend. Brilliant. I wonder if it's possible to get a blaze. Pro uh, I don't know. Let's go see if we can get him in a boat. Yeah, that's a no on the old blaze in a boat. And you definitely won't go in a boat. My friend, come, come with me. C come with me a little bit faster. I kind of want a bigger one. Is there a bigger one? Hello there. That's it, that's it, this way. Now, get off. Ah, um... Whoa. Okay. Fair enough. No, don't do that again. Ah, uh, yeah. Follow me, bruh. Please go through portals. Uh, come on, my dudes. Yes. Yes. Oh, this is going to take a while. That's it, buddy. That's, that's it. That's it. That's it, Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> oh, man. Every time he jumps, he hits his head. That's a shame. That's a real shame. Hang on a second. There are about 12 million wither skeletons over there, and I just need one. This is perfect. Hey guys, uh, just one of you, please. Thank you. Thank you. Come with me. Thank you. That's it. Oh man, it's so, so nice. Something that actually runs. We can get this done quick if he doesn't burn in sunlight. I really hope he doesn't. No, that, listen, don't do Yeah, good job. Good job. Oh, they're so easy. Perfect. This is, ah, oh. I might have to stick him in a boat until uh, nighttime, but that's fine. That's fine. We can do that. Hey, hey. Oh, okay. So he just flat out won't come out in it. That's actually pretty smart. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, well, so, okay, well, that's fine. Sunlight's not a problem then. If you could just wait there. Thank you. All right, what name should we give you? Uh, let's see. Uh, I think, uh, mm, I think Sylvester Stallone, actually. You're definitely going to need a big one, though, because you are a tall boy. Come on, Sylvester Stallone. There we are. With a skeleton. Okay, let's go get that villager. No, he's still here, look. Amazing. That is so convenient for me. Now, I, I don't actually need to protect this guy, because... If he turns, that's kind of that's kind of helping me. In fact, I should bring him up in, in the nighttime. That's it. Listen, some this guy over here wants to speak to you for a sec. <laughs> don't run off. Seriously, don't run off. You'll get lost. You'll get lost out there. I don't want you getting lost. Oh, where's he gone? Okay, listen, stay calm. Stay calm. Stay calm. Stop running. Yes. Success. Now he just has to follow me. And hopefully it doesn't turn daytime. Shrek, definitely. He kind he, he actually kind of looks like a Shrek as well. So that, that makes sense. Yes. First try. Do we have a fox? I don't think we do have a fox. Ah, oh, there's a fox right there. Amazing timing. I wonder if I can grab him with this lead real quick. Oh, I can. Come with me, my friend. Involuntarily, come with me. Okay, listen, uh, don't run away. That's easy, easy. Admiral Akbar. I, I just need to fly up in the sky to, to figure out where I'm going, all right? I'm lost. Got no idea where I'm going. Okay, I know where I'm going. Do you trust me, Admiral Akbar? Admiral Akbar, don't do this. Oh, he's trying to he's trying to kill that parrot, isn't he? Okay, I, I may have lost Admiral Akbar. I'm not gonna lie, I have I have no idea where he is. Admiral, this is bizarre. I can't find him anywhere. I don't I don't recognize any of the, any of these places. Hang on a second. Aha! All right, stay. There. Ah, you get back in there. Ha! Stretch him out. There we are. That one was actually pretty hard. I'm not gonna lie, that one was tough. Okay, I think I. Th I think you can get an endermite if you uh, if you keep spamming enderpearls on the ground. I think it spawns an endermite, right? So let's go and see if we can uh, get some enderpearls and do that. I wonder where I'll get enderpearls from. Uh, that should do. Okay. Yes, Gimli. <laughs> yes. Um, okay, Gimli, you can come right here. Yes. Ah, polar bear. I wonder if I can get a polar bear. All right, I'm sorry, but I'm taking you, baby. 
He's going to be way easier to transport. I can tell you're going to be a nightmare. Let's just get there before he grows up. It's all right. It's all right. You've got a new daddy. That felt kind of weird to say. I'm not going to lie. That one, that one felt weird. No. Oh, no. The dolphin's going to die. Okay, buddy. Not exactly the climate uh, that you're used to, I'll admit. But listen, I'm sure I'm sure we'll, we'll make do. Just being... Do not move. Do not move. Stay right there, bud. Stay right there. I should have thought this through. Follow me. Okay, I hope that didn't hurt too much. I, I did hear you squeal there. So, oh, <laughs> that's a shame. That's a shame. Look at this. Look at this. As your new dad, I do feel mildly responsible for teaching you life lessons. So, here's one. Don't be these guys. Don't be like these guys, okay? Because they end up dying. You see? See that? Where'd you go? Uh-oh, someone's someone's a big boy now. Jump. Man, Fitzgerald is a great jumper. He'd probably make a great jumper as well. Probably be really cozy. I'm joking. I wouldn't do that. All right, everyone, say hello to Fitzgerald. He's the newest addition. He's bigger and stronger than all of you, so I suggest you be nice. Apart from me, of course. Now, remember that. I think I'm going to have to make uh, Fitzgerald a bigger enclosure, you know? I think his booty's too big to get in those cages. Once I was finished building a bigger cage, I went off in search of a mountain goat, and I actually found a few. But this world was made in 1.16, which means I had to travel very far away to get one, which also means I have to travel very far back. It felt like forever. I then got pretty desperate for a slime again and tried creating a makeshift slime spawner by flattening the land, but it it didn't work. It, no, it didn't work. Okay, we still have one, two, three. We still have 15 cages free. I want to do my best to fill them all before the 100 days, and we do not have long. So now we've got to go all out. we got to do whatever it takes to get those mobs. I need that rabbit. I'll do whatever it takes to get that rabbit now. I refuse to allow him to die on that staircase. I refuse. Come here. Ha! Okay, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed this time. We can get one of these guys as well, actually. I'll be back for you. I'll be back in three hours. Okay, please don't die now. Well, listen, you've made it further than any other rabbit before you, so there's that. Okay, moment of truth. Careful. Where did that rabbit go? Do not tell me it died. Where did that rabbit go? There's no way. There's no way he just did that. Oh, he's there. Do not move. Do Careful. Careful. Careful now. No. No. Oh, I can't believe I have to do all of that all over again. I actually can. I can believe that. I hate rabbits. I'm going to have to rabbit proof this whole place. Okay, let's try again. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, now we just have to get up a staircase. Okay, as long as he doesn't go down it, he should be fine. We're just going up. Just going up. One step, one, one step at a time. No, easy. Careful now. Caref careful. I don't know how you even managed to... to hurt yourself then but just get up the thing why can't you cope with this please just climb up one more we just literally have to get it there please don't glitch out yes okay i just have to name it now yes done i can't believe it by far the glitchiest mob in the game i mean i hope he doesn't grow up otherwise i'm kind of cheating here but i'm pretty sure he doesn't grow up which means he's a di he's a separate mob okay it counts okay Ah, okay, so you've turned as well. Well, that's fine as long as you get up there so I can put you in a glass box. I'm okay with that. There it is. Here he comes. And please don't go in the jungle. Get trapped in that boat, please. Thank you so much. You don't understand. Oh, sorry about that. Here, I, I, I'll put you next to your dad, okay? The charged creeper was supposed to go here, but I, I reckon I'm going to put him in here, like in his own little container. That is, if it rains, if it ever rains. Okay, now this is going to be tricky because I can't actually get the boat up, up onto this level. Okay, okay. Now I just have to slowly build this back. Okay, if you could just hop up out of there now, please. Come on, get in the boat. Ah, fishing rod, easy. Why didn't I think of that before? Okay, I just have to get the height on it. I just got to get the height on it. Yes. Done. Done and dusted. There he is. Okay, now I'm going to build one of these uh, over here for the big iron boy. Ah, uh, yes, before I forget. Just make, sure, let's just make sure he doesn't escape. I then went to the nether to get some more materials, and when I returned, it was actually raining. Hang on a second. Is that rain? Oh, snap. You know what time it is. I, I really hope this works. What? Why isn't it working? I can literally hear thunder. Why is it not working? Why? Oh, okay, it works. <laughs> yep, that works. Okay, creeper, creeper. Where's a creeper? Where's a creeper and what am I going to name him? I have Guy and Adam. Yeah, I'm going I'm to change that real quick. I'm going to change that. Okay, let's call him Nuke. It seems like it's probably going to be a pretty fitting name. 
Oh no. Oh no. We ah oh, we killed the uh we killed the first creeper. Oh this thing is so cool. Where is a creeper though? The one time I actually need a creeper and I can't find one. Okay, I found one. I found one. Let's get rid of you. Introducing Nuke. Don't explode. We now just need to contain him briefly. We just need to make something to contain him with. Yes. Okay, he is in there. And the rain has just stopped. Okay, there can be no mistakes with Nuke. He cannot die. Okay, but now I do need like a normal creeper back, unfortunately. Okay, hopefully that drop doesn't kill him because he has already been on fire. If I can just put some water in there, that'll break his fall. That's it, that's it. Success, he is in. Ah, there he is. Doesn't he look glorious? Okay, I'm just gonna borrow some of these from back here. Um, and replace them with diamond blocks, but just pretend like you did pretend like you didn't see this Okay, I don't want to come across as someone who's like, you know, not rich. I just need some more name tags. That's all and now There it is Boomer boy. Welcome to your new home. Okay. We got the iron. Let's make this. Uh, let's make this iron boy And there he is Okay, I know we still have lots of free spaces left, but we have a total of 41 mobs and we have two days left. This I should have made this like a 200 day challenge. This this was a hard challenge. We still have five name tags left, but we're going to spend the rest of these two days making this place look as good as possible. Let's get to building. Well, it's day 101. It, it, it's actually not. I went way, I went way over on that build. It's, it's more like 105, but we're going to pretend it's 101. And that was 100 days catching as many mobs as possible in Minecraft hardcore mode. I had a ton of fun making this video. If you enjoyed it, consider leaving a like and maybe even subscribe. How about that? Let me know what you want to see next. And I'll catch you dudes in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>